Welcome to Infigyan. Today in this video we have one very interesting question from radical equations. x square plus 18x plus 30 equal to 2 times square root of x square plus 18x plus 45. We have to find its real roots and its product. So let's get started by writing our equation first. We will write x square plus 18x plus 30 and in the RHS we have 2 times square root of x square plus 18x plus 45. Now in RHS we have x square plus 18x plus 45 in the radicand and in LHS we have x square plus 18x plus 30. So let us add 15 to both sides. So I will write here plus 15. So in the LHS we will write x square plus 18x plus 30 plus 15 45 will be equal to 2 times square root of x square plus 18x plus 45. Then we have plus 15. Now in LHS and RHS we are having x square plus 18x plus 45. So let us say a square root of x square plus 18x plus 45 equal to m suppose. So for real x m must be greater than 0. Condition on m for x to be real m must be positive. Now we will be squaring both sides. We will get x square plus 18x plus 45. This will be equal to m square. So we can write our equation m square equal to 2 times m plus 15. Let me write equation here m square equal to 2 times m plus 15. Now we will subtract 2m from both the sides. So I will write here minus 2m and in RHS we will write minus 2m. So plus and minus 2m will be over from RHS. We will get m square minus 2m equal to 15. Now we will add 1 to both sides. So m square minus 2m plus 1. And in RHS, we will write 15 plus 1. So from LHS, we can write this is m minus 1 whole square. And in RHS, we will write 16. Or we can write m minus 1 whole square equal to 4 square. Now we will take square root both sides. So I will write a square root of m minus 1 whole square equal to a square root of 4 square. Now a square root and a square will be cancelled out from both the sides and we have to put plus minus sign before 4. So I will write here plus minus 4. So m minus 1 will be equal to plus minus 4. Now we will add 1 to both sides. So we will write plus 1 in the RHS also. So minus 1 and plus 1 will be over. We are going to get m value 1 plus minus 4. So we will write m should be equal to 1 plus 4 with plus sign in between and 1 minus 4 if we will take minus sign in between. 
so m will be equal to 5 and m will be equal to minus 3 but there was condition on m m should be greater than 0 for x to be real so we can reject minus 3 as minus 3 is negative number we have to accept m equal to 5 so we will write here m is equal to 5 now m was our substitution square root of x square plus 18x plus 45 equal to 5. Now we will be squaring both sides. So we will write a square root of x square plus 18x plus 45 whole square equal to 5 square. Now we will cancel a square root with a square. So we will write x square plus 18x plus 45. This should be equal to 25. Now we will take all the terms to LHS and write x square plus 18x plus 45 minus 25 equal to 0 or we can write x square plus 18x plus 20 equal to 0. Now there is one question product of roots product of real roots. So from this equation if we will use Vita's formula we will be able to find product of real roots. So I will write here product of real roots will be equal to 20 constant over leading coefficient 1. So if I will write my answer for product of real roots then we are getting 20 equal to 20. So this is our answer for product of real roots. Now we have to find real roots also. So we will be solving this quadratic equation. x square plus 18x plus 20 equal to 0. Let me write here x square plus 18x plus 20 equal to 0. Let's use quadratic formula. We'll write the values of a, b and c. a is 1, b is 18, c is constant 20. And formula is x equal to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times a c over 2 times a. Let's plug in the values of a, b and c we will get minus 18 plus minus square root of 18 square we can write 324 minus 4 times 1 times 20 over 2 times 1 is 2 will be equal to minus 18 plus minus square root of 324 minus 80 over 2 will be equal to minus 18 plus minus a square root of 244 over 2. Now 61 times 4 is 244. So we will write minus 18 61 times 4. So it will come out as 2. So we will write 2 square root 61 over 2 which will be equal to minus 9 plus minus a square root of 61. So these are our two real roots minus 9 plus a square root 61 and minus 9 minus a square root 61 
and product of roots will be product of real roots will be 20 i hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck take care bye bye